Welcome. If you haven't been here, this is a King of the Hill Nomad Hub start. Oh my god, look at this map. <laughs> this is going to be insane, guys. If you don't know what Nomad Hubs is, it's a custom-made map that Hitch made for us. We're getting Capture Age fired up in the background. And Since it is oh, insane. Boy. Got a beautiful monument in the middle that needs to be controlled. This is a Nomad start. And did they do Sudden Death? I think they did Sudden Death, right? So, <laughs> That's to Weasel's... Uh displeasure so a sudden death so if they build a tc in the middle it is kind of sketchy and kind of problematic but the hubs generate extra wood on the trees in the bog terrain and my game seems to be having some issues there we go and then on the look at the, look at these tc placements here a straight <laughs> line this is so rough for sudden death <laughs> Okay, look at this. What suits we got here? We got Hitch's Blue Byzantines, Kados is Burgundian, so OP. Weasel is Vietnamese, so Weasel's gonna be very upset when he sees the TC placements <laughs> for everybody. We well, have uh, Vikings with stale toast here. Andrew is Tatars. Uh, Jabar is Berbers. Noob is Italians. It looks like there's a bill fight here from Noob, and oh. Weasel's committed to it. He's fighting. Nope, he's he's going back. We have a big problem. We have a big problem here, though. There's no countdown on Capture Age. We can't use Capture Age. We oh. can't use Capture Age. You can try to use both. Uh, you can use it if you want to. I want to see the countdown. So okay. I am loaded back into the base game, guys. We will not be using Capture Age, which feels wrong here, but it is the way we're going without this. And mm -hmm. Athias oh. <laughs> is in the center. I think someone told him that they get res uh, because that is kind of common in like the T90 standards. And it does work. It is actually working. So he is getting free res right now. Wait, wait, wait. Oh, oh, oh my gosh, Ethan. We talked about this in the game last night. He, I, I think this I'm is great. He, he screwed up. Uh, oh, no, never mind. Okay, never mind. I was just thinking, like, did he not place his TC? Did he screw that up again? No, it's all good. He's good to go. Okay. Um, so it's going to be very interesting to see how this one goes yeah. down. Uh, we have bit quite of a mistake a from time. Weasel here going for a mill right from the start. I don't think he, that's necessary. Oh, Garrison's inside the TC. Yes, very nice, Weasel. I'm getting the bill snipe there. Oh, is he going to get another? Let's see if he gets another. Come on, get one more. I think eh, I'm gonna tune one off of us Andrew is not here. caught up, and it's you. <laughs> By the way. What I, what time are you at? I'm at four and a half minutes. That's where I just got to. And who's TC? Oh, I'm looking at Andrew's TC. My bad. Weasel's yeah. <laughs> in green. Yeah, Weasel sniped two of Andrew's uh, villagers. Now, Juicy, I want to put you in the shoes of Weasel. What are your thoughts and what are the words that are going to come out of your mouth when you build your TC and you see all the TCs lined up like this? <laughs> Shit. <laughs> <laughs> True words have never been spoken. It, it's really entertaining because really Jabari has like one of the most like best positions you could be in. Kados also in a fine position here. And everyone else is just like clustered in this line here. I mean... Stale Toast and I Am Noob are on top of each other. Then we have Andrew here. And we didn't really induce players. So Andrew here is in yellow. He's with the Tatars. Weasel is with the Vietnamese. Yeah, okay. Very well. Let's just do it again. Do it again. Just so everyone knows what's going on. <laughs> Athias here in the orange with two tons. And then we have Byzantines for Hitch. So all the players kind of in a rough position. Stale Toast is also playing as the Vikings here. This was Random Civ. It is sudden death, so TCs could be sniped, and it could be a thing of beauty here, or a thing of absolute disgust, and uh, Jabari is Berbers, so. Mm -hmm. Looks like Noob has a lot of food here. I'm sure he doesn't know. He may know that uh, uh, Steltos is beside him, but uh, he doesn't know that just south of him are two other players. Yeah, I mean, grab another boar as well. a nomad free for all King of the Hill game is insane. <laughs> I am on Athias' right point of view, though, and honestly, this res income is absolutely insane. He's got the score lead for a reason, and his I am on his POV, so you can see all of this res just ticking and ticking and ticking. It is a, quite a wonderful thing to see here. Hitch using the houses as walls here. Mm -hmm. So, a very important situation. Now, this we've talked about this line of people, and there was so something we haven't talked about, though. So, Still Toast, he has a lot of room to expand behind him. 
Hitch has the entire southern corner to expand, should he need to. Has to protect the town center with it being sudden death. But Athias started this countdown right away, and I'm super happy he did, because that speeds the process up a little bit. Mm -hmm. Oh, Weasel! Weasel dives in and takes it, though, so Weasel will now be the one collecting some free res for a moment, and then he'll mm -hmm. uh, and then lose he'll it again. immediately lose so. it. <laughs> <laughs> Probably worth us in that Woodville out there. Yeah, uh, so this is going to be something of interest for sure. I mean, Weasel probably has a big advantage because he does know where all of the opponents are with the Vietnamese team bonus. Mm -hmm. or, and also a big bonus. sense of dread. <laughs> that too. But no one else really knows unless they've walked into it. So Still Toaster knows for sure. He's walling this and, up. And Andrew, Andrew almost lost know. another bill to TC if I am noob here. Life's just kind of bad for Andrew, losing three bills. Uh, who's going to be up first, really? I feel like uh, probably uh, Kados and uh, Stale here. Probably. Athias could be, actually. He has all this free res coming in, so... He's not even on gold, and he has almost 500 gold right now. Uh, it must feel pretty good to be Jabari right now. Not near really any players... I'm sure Kato's doesn't know where he's at either, so he's in a pretty good spot. Yeah, Kato's taking the advantage here, though, as far as the uh, Civ advantage with the eco bonuses for sure. And he's dropped a bunch of farms, so he probably got Horse Collar and said, let's farm with these. I think that is a marvelous idea, actually. Matthias was the first one to get to Feudal Age. What's his game plan here? Is he going to get on gold? Is he going to go for a back? Or is he just going to go try to get to uh, castle here? Well, I think you just try to Looking get like a castle. Fast castle. He has the res. He can't build a TC in the next stage. Like but he could build a stable blacksmith, so this is going to be a fast castle build from him. Yep. Um, does he have enough res for that, though? Let's see. It's going to be a little slow on the mark there. Probably have to wait like maybe an extra minute for that. He is only 19 pop. He is a very low pop at the moment, but that yeah, free probably res... make a few. I am noob is also super low pop, so. But I think if I have to pick a position to sit in, I think I like Hitch's position the best, to be honest. His TC, his whole base is relatively close to the center. He's got the entire southern portion of this map that's pretty much free. Weasel did sneak down here with a villager, but we'll see what Weasel does that. But Weasel's back, like Jordan's back, which is exciting. Weasel's back, man. <laughs> Things should start to heat up here once we get closer. This countdown will go to 100 years, and then it will restart at 100 years every time it changes hands. But for uh, I'll now, be right back real quick. But for now, it is just going to click down the years. Looking forward to seeing how this one works out, though. Feudal Age for Kados, who has a ton of res here for Feudal Age and all of those beautiful farms. It's, it's very deceiving, though, with this pop for Athias Th here. I mean, he is sitting in a fine position. Castle Age is coming. These free ticking resources, though, is quite a bonus. He is getting some eco upgrades as well. Hitch just trying to see as much as he can here. Dropping walls everywhere that he can. Jabari is pretty safe over here. Berbers, I mean, imagine you're just going to see night spam, I would say, anyways, but hard to say. Uh, but Dark Age still for Weasel. He is not clicked up. Hitch also still in Dark Age. I don't think he is picked up either. I suppose I actually have to check their point of view. Kados is just clicked up right now. Uh, Weasel is about to hit Feudal. Second so TC immediately for Ethan, so he's going to look like for a. Sort of a little boom into military play here. You now stabilize his economy and then kind of play after that. Yeah, He's also Thias. going for a castle immediately. Athias so is really going much control. all in 
at the beginning here. He wants to control this. Oh, and, and look at this. Look at this, these tower shenanigans. Manager here. He's, he's probably going to get the have the tower denied. Yeah, I think Andrew could be a dead man here after this. He's going to lose. He's clicking so mad men right now. He Loses gets it so up. So many bills. But it won't gets it stay up, up, but at what cost? What cost? And it won't stay up either. There's no way. It's quite unfortunate. Disaster for Andrew right now. It's things could not possibly get any worse for Andrew right now as he is on 25 pop. Yeah, it's going to go down even more as well. Here, so Hitch is just massively walling his base right now. <laughs> and it is a beautiful thing to see. Blacksmith Market, he'll be going Castle Age before too long. I, it's like Kados, a PC from Jabari. Is it? Kados with the Burgundians, I feel like, could be very, very good for killing TCs. Getting yeah. that quick Paladin and Imp. Maybe just Crab Cavalier in general. Oh, they didn't the do scene. Sudden Death then. A TC being built by Jabari here. Oh, yeah, it's okay. So we're seeing Teutonic Knights. Just a single Teutonic Knight there guarding his, uh, his cathedral. Oh, he's got a very Knight, nice. Spearman, Scout. A very, very AI army composition there. Weasel's running with economy right now. He wants out of this mid, so it's definitely not sudden death. 100% there's no way it is. TCs are popping up. Mm -hmm. I can just imagine like what Weasel is saying right now. It's like, I gotta get out of here. Like I'm getting out of here away from you people. Yeah, Geo, you can 100% do Sudden Death, King of the Hill. Uh, T90 just did it not long ago on like an Acropolis style mega random. That's how you I see know a it's castle possible. drop from uh, Stale here, but is that going to be a Dal Castle? It looks like it's going to be maybe, maybe it could be Dal Castle. No. Oh, he's going for it. He's going for it. It's going up. It's just archers, and there's only a few of them. Uh, this castle kick. Oh, things are going to look bad for Noob here because down south of him. Is Andrew? He's gonna have to run. Yep. For He's gonna sure. get a tower, but it's already too late here. Yeah, and this is gonna be you. an interesting position to have in this north corner because now that we know it's not sudden death, I mean, there's a lot of room to expand. Lost one build to the castle. Oh, feels bad. Yeah, I hope that was communicated between the players because I was under the assumption we were playing. Uh, Weasel death. specifically did not want. Uh... Sudden death. Well, it's very, I wasn't, very I wasn't asking for what he wanted. <laughs> <laughs> I'm assuming everyone was just like, okay, we'll do what he wants. <laughs> I guess, but that's fine. I mean, it's still, it's King of the Hill, so it's not like this can go on forever. I mean, the resources on this map could, because there are tons of resources on this map. We're seeing Cavalier come to the middle right here. These three Cavalier take out the, I don't think they can take out all this. I think Kados knows that, so he's just bailing out there. Yeah, I think he was hoping to take that monument, because if you look at Athias' economy right now, he has so much going for him with all this free res. His top score for a reason. He's top score with a lot of points coming in. He's, what, 400 points ahead of the second highest score, which is Kados right now? Mm -hmm. Kados oh. jumping in, man. Kados, haven't seen him play some team games or anything in a while, so... Good to have no, him man. around here. Weasel like Jordan, coming Kato's back. Is back. <laughs> Weasel has a very unique position with some of his villas in the south. I'll see if that gives him anything there. Yeah. I feel like but... in like Nude's position here, he's just just run, just run your eco to the uh, left corner there, because you should probably guess that no one's there. Yeah. I mean, then again, in his situation, he probably doesn't know that. Yeah, Jabari is on four TCs. He is booming. Oh, he's running. He's running, man. He's running all, all thirty-four bills there. Yeah. He. I mean, he doesn't really yeah. have another choice at this point. He's got the castle. It's like screw that main TC, even though this one bill is uh, pathing quite poorly. There you go. Yeah, and this is actually really good for Andrew. Weasel is under a T under a tower with archers, and there's another tower there. So Weasel <laughs> having archers on the field, not getting much done there. Honestly, Weasel should just TC down south here. He really should. Actually, wait, wait, wait. Is he still in feudal? Yeah, he is. So is Andrew. He's still in feudal. Oh, no. Okay, he's good at the castle. He's 50%. And Andrew is uh, yet to click. So it's, it's looking like a very odd, odd situation. Hitch is the only player that is full walled at the moment. Mm -hmm. And uh, 
You know, he is only one TC, though. So we'll see how that works out for him here. Oh. Real question is, can Ethan hold mid here once Kados and Jabari get up? Well, if we take a look at his res situation, he has got the gold. He's got lacking food, really, is his issue. He needs more farms. He needs more yep. on food to produce. Looks like uh, Noob is doing exactly what I said. He's going over there to the left corner, and this is just going to boom there. Boom back into the game. Yep. So screw my old eco. I'm moving out. And feel bad for Andrew here because now it, it's looking like a bad situation for him because at least Noob is now is in a much better position or is a lot safer. But Andrew, he's like, like, I don't know, like five Cavalier from all those Palisades going down and just losing all of that farm in gold eco. Yeah, I mean, he is Tatars. He is playing tower defense essentially uh athias has clicked imperial age by the way so he is going up first i believe and first uh game, man but i mean he has he has the highest uh pop right now 84 vils he's doing a really good job booming looks like that practice paid off good job man i must have fallen behind here again nope i'm at 27 minutes here 27 yep. 18 so that's that's where i'm at too all right, not bad, not bad. So, okay, what do you go for here as Ethan? You're against, likely you're going to be against Berbers and uh You have Gundians. to go Paladin, I feel like. Paladin, maybe? Or maybe you could do like something like Halb Teutonic Knight or something. I think you go Paladin right. Halb. That's your best option. Mm -hmm. I mean, was Jabari, it depends. Is Jabari going to go Camel Archers? He probably will. Uh, he doesn't have but one barracks in the field. He is probably going Cavil Archers. Kados, what does Kados have in this Siege Workshop? One Magnil. One Magnil. So not too much. But, I mean, players are starting to expand mm -hmm. on the map. And Looks it, like Weasel is committed to trying to kill Andrew here. Hitch is going Cataphract. He's already got some pumping out. Fully Cataphract here. He's a little slightly bigger eco though. He has the lowest build count in everybody right now. Actually, no, Andrew has the lowest build count. Yeah, he has He's one TC in comparison. That's probably why. So, I'm sure Andrew had the rest click up, but he didn't realize he didn't have a didn't have the right buildings. Yeah. Okay, Weasel is building a second TC down south. He really should expand down here. Just take control of this corner and and then hitch his like suddenly in shock there, so it takes focus off there. Yeah, and Weasel hasn't reacted to this castle that Ethan has dropped, so he needs to run. Same many bills and kills. <laughs> he needs Same to run. And kills. One, two. He's, he's Quite running, a few. He's running the whole thing out. <laughs> and he's going to run right past another castle here. I, we're at 201 years. This is going to be... Now it looks like Weasel's getting some revenge here. He's going to kill a few vills in the gold. He's also going to kill these Teutonic Knights. It's going to be really important for some... People just pay attention to the center of the map here, though. Oh, but we have Kados and Jabari fighting each other, actually. Yeah, interesting. Kados will take down a town center. Might even do some raiding. Uh, players may start to forget about the important of middle here. I mean... Well, so, it looks like Jabari's is going to go... He's making a lot of Teutonic Knights. He's already a 6 up, and he's making Knights as well. So he's just going to go Knights and Teutonic Knights. I mean, there's nothing wrong with it. Quite just the depends. Comp. Just depends. We do have some uh, cataphracts that could be something there, but oh, Athias is going after Andrew, or he's going after Weasel. He's kind of attacking both here. I don't really know what his plan is. Here, I come hope uh, Hitch sees Weasel. Weasel, so it just makes things worse for him. <laughs> I hope that Weasel hangs on in there and can contribute to the mid because honestly, before long, I feel like. The middle could be forgotten here, and honestly, if I am in Ethan's position, I just build castles, buy stone, build castles, wall this in the middle. Like he's had no opposition. Weasel walked in with one villager, and he's sitting at a really good spot here. Get more castles everywhere. Just get so much control. Oh, castle team. drop for Steel Toaster, and Kados is gonna see that, and he should be able to deny that. It should be a doubt castle, no question. It's like the Lord is with us in this game. Very good. 
This is actually really bad for Stealth Toaster here. I feel like this is a terrible time to take a fight when I mean, you have Cavalier here. Yep. I'm sure he was probably thinking like, oh, I could get this castle up and everything would be fine, and things are just looking pretty bad for him right now. Yeah, this will clean up the economy here for Stealth Toaster, too. Like, it's going down, no question. That castle will never go up. Even if it goes up, it won't stay up for very long. So, uh, what's uh, Noob been doing? He's just, just booming, booming in the back here. He can't really do he's much. Going for, he's going for a TC down there, but Hitch is already there, man. Yeah, things are getting quite messy. Athias actually going over and attacking Jabari's base, trying to see what's going on here. 150 yep. years left. Middle important. Oh, and here comes the castle. So we do have castles. He has a market now, so maybe he's going to be able to buy some more. I think that... Even if everyone went to the middle with 100 years, I don't know if this would fall. He's well, he only just two need... people an imp. Uh, Kados just needs Paladin. It's Paladin to run in there and take that. Yeah, but he's not hes not up yet. That's true. He's, he's more focused on killing Stale right now. And that was purely defensive, really. I thought he might even stop here. He might not even bother coming back. Well, Andrew is still alive, but his whole population is right here in the mid. He is trying to retreat to some vills. He's going to run into uh, Noob's TC here. He's going to place down farms. I don't agree with that at all. You really should place down a TC instead of farms. That's Andrew's choice. It's not a very good choice. He's just going to run right into Noob's TC. Noob's probably not going to notice because he's going to... Might be more focused on booming right now. Yeah, so and what is he? Okay, we're, he's just booming. We're getting closer and closer to this being an issue. And full Teutonic Knight spam. It will soon be Cavalier. And here come yeah. the Cavalier from Kados, but with less HP. Yeah, you know. These Cavalier Teutonic Knights, they'll eat Burgundian Cav for days here. Yeah, and the castle being here. Both castles going to contribute to this. More knights coming. Conscription coming. Now, the res behind this for Athias isn't the greatest in the game, but he is sitting comfortably at 111 vils at the moment. Yep, all that military is just going to go bye-bye from Kato's here. Oh, and Hitch, is Hitch on. raiding in the north? He does have oh. cataphracts. And, yeah, he is. He's going to find the three vils from Andrew. <laughs> <laughs> oh, no. Oh, no. He's also finding the uh, vils trying to build a castle Look at the, here. Get a conversion. Get to go for the conversion. Oh no, the muck's gonna go down. No. All right, so Kados and Jabari have made efforts to get into the middle now, and it's starting to look very, very promising here. Almost at yeah, 100 but he's years. Making two, yeah, but he's making uh, camels against Teutonic Knights. Soon, probably Paladin too, right? I would assume, but not enough gold or food, really. Food's his issue. Yeah, he really needs to get some more bills. I mean, how many bills is that? 106. 106. He needs to take a lot of them and make them into farmers. A patch of uh, wood choppers. Weasel, to Weasel farmers. with the ram train. He's coming in with the rams in the north. <laughs> They're battering rams, but he's going to try to take that castle down. Uh, I'm not sure either will know, too. This castle might just go down for free, but if he's easy, he'll just pop out some Teutonic Knights and save it. Oh, he notices. He sends oh, Cavalier towards Ethan's it. Ethan's about to build another castle. It's a beautiful castle in the middle. I don't think they kill him. I think you fully commit here. I think you send all your vills, everything, to the middle. Uh, I feel like Jabari is just going to continue but... making camels and not realize that Ethan is just going to Teutonic Knights. Going to Teutonic Knights and camels don't do anything to them. This is looking to be a very, very quick game here. The Rams didn't even take out the castles. There still are a few of them here, but... <laughs> Heavy camel upgrade, I don't even think will be in very quickly, but I assume that's what we're going to see from Jabari. Kados, not in Imperial yet, needs those paladins. Another castle going up. Man, this is, it just feels like there's not enough urgency from the middle here. Yeah, they're too busy fighting each other here. Going, As, uh, Stale is probably going to go full infantry, full pike in Berserker Gang. I believe most everyone's new to community games as far as playing goes, and I think that they don't realize that it's this close. Someone has to realize Ping Center and be like, everyone mid now or we're out, it's done. Elite uh, and, Teutonic Knights coming in, let's go. 
Yeah, <laughs> Leaf Two Tonic Knight, let's go. Yeah, and and Jabari is continuing to making the wrong unit here. You should see that like infantry, range units, must make range units to kill Two Tonic Knight. Yeah, Stale Toast, not really not able to do much. Him and Kados have been fighting another castle. It's denied here. And I think this is just going to end. Oh, the Trebs. There are Trebs from Jabari. This is a good touch. And Noob is up to Imperial Age right now. So here oh. is Crenellations coming in. But <clears throat> Trebs starting to take out castles. Military, obviously, a little bit better for Ethan here. But here come the Cavalier. So they are starting to converge on the mid. There are a few bugged Cavalier in the middle, though, so there's no ranged units. There's no ranged units. No ranged units. He's making heavy camel against mm. Teutonic Knight. And I wouldn't be surprised if he loses this. And you just said the Teutonic Knight's back in here, and it just oh, the Cavalier will just die. Well, they, the can, they can never stay. take it without range. <laughs> no one's making ranged units right now. Range units, please. A weasel's the only hope. He has some Rattan Archers and some Crossbows. But he's probably mentally tapped out. So Make it Hussar against Teutonic Knights. Why? So Ethan is going to win this game just by holding the mid from the beginning, basically. Good job, Ethan. Though, to be fair, he is eating the castle with the Teutonic Knights. He needs to stop that. But Why? I mean, he has the res to make the switch to, um, what's it called, to uh, Camel Archers, but he's not doing it. Uh, this castle why. coming up here for Jabari will not range. Kato's and Stales, and Stales pushing on the pressure fighting on him. each other. Yeah, fighting each other to the death here. That's good. Hitch, just the booming madman over here, has yet to even go to the mid. Yeah, and uh, looks like Noob is expanding down towards uh, Hitch right now. Maybe looking for a little revenge from last time. Yeah, but, I mean, before anything really occurs now, it's just going to be GG before long. Yeah, you think uh, you think uh, Jabari would take this if he had, uh, you know, camel archers with his camels? I mean, it would have definitely been more convincing here, for sure. These two top knights will kill all these camels. Paladin on its way for Athias here. But I don't think there's any way that this dies. The cataphracts from Hitch are on their way. He has decided to come to the mid, but again, no ranged units. They're bugged in the middle. The Cavalier for Athias are going to win. Oh, here they come. This is what this is the break you needed. The Teutonic Knights will now get melted. And the Cataphract is still going to be so dominant here because Cataphract, they'll take, they take less bow damage than the Camels. They're going to be a really good unit here. Yeah, but I still don't think they can kill this. <laughs> There's no range. <laughs> no one makes range units. That's what the Weasel. title of this Oh, game Weasel's be. moving. He's too late, though. He's too late. He'll never make it. Oh, and it's going to be GG because no one range range unit. Oh, there's calf archers. They're not going to be in time. Their paladins glitched into the cathedral. GG's. Oh. <laughs> Athias takes the game. He gets really fortunate here. And, oh, it's so, so good for him. Difficult to see that they're bugged out in the middle. Even if they weren't bugged out, though, there are still units here. So I think he would have been fine. Yeah, but... I think it came down to, like, lack of range units, lack of... I mean, to be fair, Hitch is making the right unit here. He's making the counter unit against two top knights, but he's... people should have been a lot quicker to act on in the middle here. Everyone's just kind of fighting each other, and that led to everyone's downfall. Yep, GG's. Well, I hope you guys enjoyed that one. That will be the end of that one. If you did see this video on YouTube, be sure to like, follow, subscribe, share, all those lovely things. If you're on Let's Twitch, go talk to we're going to go talk to him and get into some more games.